a Phil Punter. Currently running the Pro Shop, Anglian Pro Shop at um, Namco Funscape Norwich. Ex firefighter for nearly 30 years. Bowling 40 years. Yeah, about 35, 40 years bowling. And love the sport. Temping bowling to me is a is a life choice. It's 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 not a hobby. Everybody has to find something, don't they, in their lives. And this is it, you know. My earliest bowling memory was one evening being invited by my then wife's sister's boyfriend to go to RAF Bentwaters, which is an American air base, in 1975 and bowl for his team because he was short. And I went up there that night, never bowled before, got one strike and that strike set me on a path to where I am now. Pro shop to me means giving something back to the sport. You, don't, you certainly don't run a pro shop to become a millionaire because there's not that much money in the trade. Whilst I was a firefighter at Ipswich, I got friendly with an American, Mike Goff, and he taught me how to drill a ball. And that's where it started from there. The pro shop is, a, is your friendly meeting place where bowlers come to meet, they come to discuss balls, bowling, everything you need really to get out on the lanes and, and have a game. There's a 300 game in every ball I drill. As I say to my customers, it's just up to you to find out where I've put it. We bowl and that's it. There are, obviously there are other things in my life, yeah, my kids, my partner, but bowling plays a, a big part in my life and it always has done and I hope it always will. The first thing I'm doing, I'm making sure that the ball surface is clean. While you're doing that, you're trying to visualise the shape of the shot that you want to commit to the next time you step up onto the lanes. So I'm in a positive frame of mind before I even step up on the approach. Once you're on the approach, you're looking at your marks on the lane, where you're stepping, where you're standing. Yeah? Then make sure you load the ball properly, so you've loaded the ball into your hand, your stance is good, the ball's in the right position, everything feels good. You've got nice, relaxed shoulders, yeah? And you're ready to bowl. Commit to the shot. Trust the ball to do the work. Just watch the shot until it hits the pins. And in my case, you always leave a 10 pin, so then you pick the spare ball up and have a go at that. So. What does bowling mean to you? Um, friendship. It means getting to know lots of people excitement, disappointment, it's just the whole, the whole range of feelings you can get coming up here bowling. It's a bit like the fire service really. You're a family, that's what it means, family. You, you can actually learn quite a lot about yourself bowling. Frustration, learning how to cope with disappointments. Okay, you get disappointed sometimes. But you get over it, you know. You know, you, you, you get to a competition, you're doing really well, and then all of a sudden you have a really bad game, you know, and everything's against you. But you have to learn to pick yourself up and start again. 
and it's the same in life. Yeah, I mean, there are times when things go terribly wrong and you've just got to learn to, right, let's get up and start again and don't let the grind you down. Thank you. 